Have you ever wondered what it's like to be a full-time digital nomad and travel the world on a motorcycle, visiting places that people have never even heard of, exploring beautiful nature, and basically living life to the max? Well, in this video, you'll get to see what it's like to be a digital nomad for a day, floating down a class two river, experiencing the thrill and excitement of kayaking down a class two plus or three minus river for the first time ever, and then hiking through a remote jungle to swim and snorkel in a perfectly pristine crystal clear lagoon and then finally traversing a canyon in a rickety homemade cable car. been on the road now for four months. It hasn't been easy, but then again, nothing amazing ever is. For the next 10 years, my goal is to travel the world on an adventure motorcycle so I can meet and learn about new people and cultures, connect with the incredible nature all over our planet, and share it all here on the channel. I'm a minimalist at heart and obsessed with experiences. This is my path, and I hope to inspire you on yours. Of course you're going so slow, but going so I see that I follow them or why I get lost. Super exciting day. We are going to do some kayaking or rafting. I'm here at the Omega Tours Lodge and uh, excited beyond belief. We have the little trick here you just walk with a kayak resting on your hip and it's actually pretty light and easy. It goes from being a pain in the ass to like whatever. That looks like a turkey vulture. So the guide was telling me that this part of the river, he said it's way too dangerous even for professional kayakers to come down because there's a lot of traps and a lot of places where if the kayak goes in, you're not coming out. Yeah, baby. And now it's just floating down the river, baby. Oh gosh, this is so fun. And we're not even kayaking yet. Oh my god, I can't I can't believe this. Puedes seguir. Ve por la derecha. Muy bien. What a day, man. This is absolutely just mind blowing. Probably the most fun I've had since I don't even remember. Just in heaven. Wondering if this would even be possible to climb this boulder right here. I'm sure if you're a world class climber, maybe. But so much potential here if you're bouldering, climbing, kayaking, or just want to be in the most amazing river ever. Highly recommend it. Honduras, baby. Vuelta, vuelta, vuelta. Oh! <laughs> Pura suerte! Allá también! <laughs> Good day today, man. And it's not even noon. <laughs> Seriously, amazing. One of the best days I've had in... I have no idea how long, but 100% addicted to this. It's all I need now. It's another addiction. But what can you do? I don't have a choice in this. Amazing. These are some of my favorite little plants here. When you touch them, look what happens. They get super scared and protective. So cute. We're at the Green Lagoon here. A little secret spot. I'm gonna get back in the water here because it just looks too amazing. And he's got a mask for me, so it'll be fun. Like a thousand, and this is what it feels like. Oh, God. 
We're gonna do the river crossing. Okay. They go a little fashion way. Never done one of these little like, not sure if we can trust this thing, but we'll find out. I technically entered El Salvador on any permission without a passport. Anything goes wrong, it's gonna be crazy. My gas is running out. Oh my god, no way. God, this is not good. Hola, la gasolinera, ¿dónde está? La gasolinera. ¿A cuánto? ¿Cuántos metros? And I'm out. Completely out of gasoline. Oh yeah, not 